Welcome back. We're gonna play Frederick, the Resurrection of Music. Uh, new game. Too easy. Alright, here we go. In Paris. Present day. Well, um, dang, somebody woke up on the wrong side of the coffin. <laughs> LBV? Yeah, hate it when that happens. You just wake up like 200 some years later and suddenly everything's changed. How do you adjust to that? But also, this seems too dark for this sort of atmosphere. Let me guess. Greetings, Frederick. Oh. Who are you? The Muses. It's us, the Muses, whom you asked for inspiration so many times. Nettie, Hypertie, and Nancy. We sense that you returned. We want to help you. Since you left, no other master has appeared. Dear really? Ladies, I'm honored. I wanted to... Piano, quiet. <laughs> we haven't got much time. We bring you artifacts of great power. They may not be blades in a chain, but they are also extraordinary and almighty. When really? Names, this carriage will take you to any place in this world. And this <laughs> is your grand piano. We hid it so that it could wait for you when you return. Wow. A pocket-sized one, ideal for traveling. But when you take it out, it will revert to its natural size. So that you can hone your skill whenever and wherever. Dear ladies, thank you for your gifts. I hope you can also tell me... Piano Frederick, time takes no prisoners. We have to go. Really? It might be too late. Something happened? You know. We're a king, Greek salad advert for a famous and influential fast food chain. Our careers depend on this. Oh, yes. But... Frederick. What am I watching? And good luck. Okay. Why am I here? What am I supposed to do? I... So, we have Greek muses. Chopper, you need not have the gold. Okay. Who are you? You should have stayed on the other side. There's no frequency for you here. Who are you? <laughs> Jacques, the greatest musician in the world. I'm on it. There's no place for you here anymore. I'm sure we could come to some kind of agreement. Okay. <laughs> in that case, give me. Hand over the grand piano. That's not what I had in mind. Bow voluntarily before electronic powers. Give in, and I will leave you with remnants of consciousness capable of feeling something other than pain. Never! Unbending indeed. I have always admired you for that. But still, I will process you into a sample for my cyber bando. He, he does know he's only got two hands, right? Musical you. Anything but serenades. All right, let's play. Really? Really? Ugh. Okay. Um. That was the weirdest intro sequence I've ever seen to any game ever. Frederick versus Jean. Prelude in E minor, Opus 28, Number Four. 
Oh man. Uh. Wait, how do I know when you're supposed to strike these? Do do. Okay, this is a bit too easy, on too easy mode. Having actually played the real funeral piece, this is... is this really it? Um, I've played this piece before on an actual keyboard, though. Well, actually on a real piano. Is that telling me that I could use a spacebar to pedal? I feel though if you had a larger keyboard, this might be a little bit easier to pick out what the notes are. Okay, I got that fine that phrase. Man, I don't know which is more distracting, the fact that, like, this differs so much from the actual piece, or... Um, yeah, I don't know what's most distracting about this. The fact that it's like that rock band with keyboard, except not nearly as many keys. Ha! <laughs> but apparently I get credit for this on too easy mode, so... But yeah, I hope that, that we get a larger keyboard. Man, poor guy. Musicality. Accuracy, 87. Let's go on to the next one. Hopefully it's more imaginative. Enough, enough, I give up. I tell you everything. Then speak. Why did you attack me? It's Seriously. Not my fault. It's all because of him. He talked me into it. The one who brought you back. He said that if I defeated you, I'd be famous again. Really? I wouldn't have to leave off my pension. Wait, who's this guy? Who is this he? Why did he bring me back here? I don't know. He wore a mask and a hood. He said he had a great plan and I would benefit from it. Maybe others no more. He said that if I didn't succeed, there were other musicians. He said he was flying to the world's capital of culture. Wait a minute. The cultural capital? That could be Paris, I guess. Mm. You no kidding. Not from this century. Now all the big things are in the USA. He was talking about New York. How true what? strange. America? I do need to know why I returned here. It's how time is, to fetch the carriage. How's New York the capital? America. I am so confused about this plot. Okay, we'll just accept that um yeah, that's not New York. Well, except that the carriage somehow transported us across the ocean. Um, that's like the least disturbing fact among all of us. What a journey! The carriage may have been fast, but rather uncomfortable. I'll spend the night on this beach. <laughs> Probably could have just gone to. Okay. Get those bad vibes off my beach. But I'm not sad. I have only been reflecting. You've been humming some blue tunes with a long face. Optimism rules here. Really? 
This place You've not heard Chopin. Feel depressed, uneasy. It was a normal beach until you landed here to hum these nocturnes. But chill. Really? Fix it. Are these all nocturnes? When do I get to play like fantasy and bronze? See, old man, it's better already. Truly a powerful effect. Wait, don't I know you? What's your name, bro? Frederick Chopin, at your service. Chopin? You ruined my childhood. When I really? Five, they told me to pluck the grand piano like you. Have you any idea how I suffered? Everybody played reggae. And I played the piano. Uh huh. But it wasn't me. It was them who made you. I right. Pull any chicks with music like also, if you were any good at playing the piano, for 30 years, then it, you wouldn't have suffered so much. Now I'm like a born again man. Really? <laughs> no, Yama. I still suffer from trauma. And now I'll paint you yellow, red, and green. Okay. These introductions are getting stranger and stranger. Frederick versus. Polonaise and A flat. Opus 40, number one. I don't remember. What, what's the Polonaise in A-flat? I don't remember this piece. Do, do, do. I don't remember this piece at all. It sounds like a Bob Marley piece. It really does. I knew this piece. Wait, no key change? How do you do this with no key change? Okay, I found where the F key is on my keyboard. Oops, am I what? I'm playing the R and the F keys incorrectly. It's like I'm trying to play this like a real piano, and it's not working at all. Close enough. Oh, I can activate like star power or something. All right. Victory. Maybe. Do...
Yeah, I don't recognize this piece at all. Yeah! Okay. Man, he doesn't look happy. He really doesn't look happy. Um, so this is supposed to be too easy mode. And I kind of floundered my way through that. But... Musicality. Sure. Combo of three. Let's move on and pretend that we didn't happen. played beautifully. Maybe now you could answer some of my questions. Yep. What was that? Was he really here, or was nope. it just a spectre which appeared in my dream? It's just your dream. Clearly, the local fumes aren't too healthy. The day is dawning. High time I continued my journey. Yeah, let's get to New York already. That's not New York. That's very much not New York. Really, you could use a map. Also, Miami is not that close to Mexico. But, to each their own. Careful. Excuse me. Could you tell me how to get to New York? Someone held me up there by the fence and wires. And when they found out I was Polish, they said I had to have some kind of visa. Seriously, get a GPS. Frederick Chopin. Who? Well, Frederick Chopin. Frederick who? Guys, you know him? Never. 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 Really? The well known composer? Like Hyde, Strauss, Beethoven? The very Strauss. It's nice of you to put me in such noble company. Wait. How come he's well known if we don't know? Tell us some of your hits. Well, classical music, concerts on the grand piano. Impossible. Nobody writes pieces like that anymore. I, I, I didn't think. I thought you was dead. You should have <laughs> said from the start that you want to Sit down. We're going. For what it's worth, I can't hear it either. That scene is apparently pretty quiet. Oh, another bus from the Elvis rap. Glad I'm through, boy. Hmm. <laughs> Are they all overweight? How can you afford to do that in this kind of weather? Mexican culture doesn't have like Marian statues and crosses everywhere. Gentlemen, gentlemen, take it easy. I'm a composer. They call me Frederick Chopin. That's irrelevant. It's not personal. We're sheriffs, and we simply run out of alcohol. Really? We'll burn your side. 
I'm so confused. It seems like the writers ran out of material. Can't they just, like, have him play a song for them? understand. This game makes no sense whatsoever. Oh, but also it's on summer sale, so go get it. Frederick versus Sheriff. Sonata in B flat number two. I don't remember this one. Oh really this one? Do 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 Proper fingering is quite important. Syncopation gets me every time. Do 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 do. okay. And yes, I agree, that is a very classy tutu. Yeah, I think this piece could do a lot better with a much larger keyboard, however. Also, the for those unfamiliar with that um, sonata, it's typically played much slower. Typically. No, no! 
That's impossible! Don't worry. You dance, swung like, and that's it. We all went through it. Let's shoot him anyway! We will give you a hard time. But it's time to leave this hall. Can you just, like, guide him to New York, please? But your work is here. You are sheriffs. You crazy? We're brokers. You know, everybody's got their innocent fantasies. Later. Mm hmm. I'm gonna withhold comment on that political situation. Oh, hey, look. We found New York. Uh, I'm guessing this is not the city because. Appearances can be deceptive and the not too crowded. May be misled, but. Excuse me, gentlemen, is this the world's capital of culture? Tis so, bro. Welcome to our neighborhood. I'm honored. Frederick Chopin, at your service. Never heard of you, but that's not your fault. We're very busy here. I can see. And who do I have the pleasure of meeting? I'm N. N., chief of the greatest musicians in the world. We are the Knights of Notes. Our music what? is the fight for justice in this world. A revolution? What? Yep, bro. This world's existence can be purified only by unconditional loyalty to ideals. This attitude is similar to What? Me. Can I help you in any way? Thank you for your generous offer. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Our just cause will be supported by the wheels from your carriage. What? How are they to help the cause? They look sexy. They go well with my teeth. This cannot be. Return the wheels. If you want them back, you must play something that will knock us off our feet. Really? We agreed to deal with you. Stand up and fight. I challenge you to a children's card game. Frederick versus N. N. Pones, an A flat minor, Opus 53. Faster. like double whole note steps of like a distance of two white keys or a distance of a white key from a non-adjacent black key it's just like it's very different on a real piano than what I'm trying to do here
I was never that great at popping music either. But, you know, maybe if I can master Chopin here or Fred. If I could if I master this game, maybe I could try popping music again sometime. But the fact that like the letter keys are stacked on top of each other is very different from a real piano or keyboard. So that's more than a bit challenging. Like playing the actual piece on a real piano would be a lot simpler than playing what I'm doing. Musicality. All right, next piece. That was a nice arrangement, though. You said something about agreeing to duel with me. Who set you up to it? One guy came here. Don't know him. From a one different guy? district, I guess. But looked like one of us. He had this huge hood, and you should have seen his ride. He promised each of us was gonna get one like that, and we were gonna be famous. And did he say why he wanted the fight, or where he is at the moment? He said we'll give you his name. Plan, and he was gonna cross the whole country and an ocean somewhere. Don't remember the name. What's the point of knowing the world if here is the best place? We had a look at his amazing gold signet rings. I only care about trinkets and carriages, and have probably never heard of the Philharmonic or the theater. And this is supposed to be the world's capital of culture? The capital. It's not here, not this address. If you want to see the world's capital, please come to Tokyo. Really? Japan? Well, you need to cross the whole country and an ocean. Why not? <laughs> Why not? That makes sense. Sure. That's what I do. You know, when I don't have something better to do. That's one awesome carriage to go all the way across the ocean. Hopefully this is a more... Oh! Check that out! Somebody's actually heard of Fred. And unfortunately he doesn't speak English. Seems legit. For once. It seems like what might actually happen in Japan if Frederick Chopin were to suddenly appear. Excuse me, but you are playing so beautifully. Can I record some of this music as a ringtone for my mobile phone? I don't fully understand what you mean, but go ahead, little boy. Thank you, sir. Finally, the whole world will shake. After years of captivity, I am free again. Also seems legit for Japan. What are you? A demon of music sounds. A hellish destroyer of instruments. I hope that you don't want to destroy my grand piano. I do. This is why I appeared in this world. But, you know, this is a big... Did Chopin even own a grand piano? A huge destroyer. I may be small, but I have a huge robot. I feel like he might not have. Fight with me. If you lose, I'll devour the grand piano. Together with For many the reasons. <laughs> that changes things. Let's fight them. The life of a musician is never easy. Frederick versus Oltak! Wrong! A minor. Posthumous. Okay. Okay.
do. This is like that turnaround piece, right? Turn around. Alright. I have to admit, I've not heard this source piece. I'm sure whatever the source piece is, is a lovely piece. Does anybody recognize this piece at all? Because I don't. On the other hand, I did quite awesomely for not knowing the source material. Um, but I think that one might have been easier to read than most, if less familiar. Dang, that's loud. Sorry about that. Eh, not bad. 97%. No. He promised that I would defeat you. He promised. He defeat you? Who? Who told you this? I don't know. Who? A mysterious guy in a hood. We met in Moscow, and he said I was the chosen one. And ah, Moscow. I could defeat you. Eh, uh, sorry, but it didn't work. Oh, oh. so now, <laughs> terrible fate awaits me. What fate? I'm going back to school. Wonder if we could get that one piece in C minor. I'm trying to remember the name of it. It's Etude in C minor. I wonder if we're going to get that. Still working on learning it, but also it expects beautiful some... music, so classical. No, I could see a connoisseur. Come over here and join the day. Let me treat you to a glass of hot tea from a salmon. With pleasure. The day is somewhat cool for a long walk. I don't exaggerate. Yesterday I sent my grandchildren on holiday camping by a river. Here you are. Hot tea. Fabulous tea. I tea. already feel relaxed. Non alcoholic? Um, what is this music? Beautiful, if a little slow. Slow? <laughs> That's really fun. This is a recording of my last concert. I am a famous pianist. There isn't anyone strong enough not to fall asleep during my concert. <laughs> I put the whole Grand Theater to sleep. Carnegie Hall in Sicilia. Sydney Opera House. Anyway, look at the street. I turn the speaker and people fall asleep while walking. Really? Indeed, they fall asleep, but only some of them. The militia man on duty and the man with the bottle. They were actually almost asleep anyway. I myself feel only slightly relaxed. 
and that might be only because of the tea. Stop, Raphael Ophen. And what kind of a novel are you? You think you could do better than... As it happens, I am a pianist and a composer, and mm -hmm. obviously I could do better. You what? Let's have a bet. Bring what? It. I love gambling. Let's play and see on which side of the square more people will fall asleep. Very well then. To work. Okay. <laughs> Seems like a noble ambition. And in no way harming the general populace. Frederick versus Vasily! Nocturne in E flat major, I think. Do 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 I should try this on a more difficult setting. this game is a good choice. Even if it is pretty ridiculous. somebody good at this game would look like. I really do wonder. Yeah, that nocturne, like the left hand, is ridiculous in that piece. Um, well, I mean, it's a typical waltz, but... It's just difficult for an intermediate pianist, um, an amateur light as myself. Musicality. All right, musicality. He says. That was cool. How like mid contest there just. You really do need to wake up. It zoomed out and showed the city in pan. Loosen my covenant? Where am I? Ah, oh, deary me. I had a dream that I was young again. Oh, that <laughs> I remember now. Looks like I've lost. It would appear so, yes. Now, since you've lost, tell me if there was somebody who talked you into this bet. Actually. How shall I put it? Uh, there was this man in, in a hood. Hood. Like the kids of today were. Really? He promised money. 
Personally, I don't trust those rotten, well, those business people. But you know, my pension is low, and he mm -hmm. loves. Mm -hmm. And have you any idea where I could find him now? I don't think he said, but I know one thing. You can find all the answers in your mother country. But of course, Poland. I'll be off. I must have Poland? been away from my country for centuries. Okay. Yeah, let's trek there. But also, I think technically, more people fell asleep on the other side of the street, or the pianist fell asleep. Just saying. I think we know who actually won that bet. Or wager. What a journey! I was shaken and tossed about like, say, on unpolished roads. Man, I wonder who drags that carriage. I'm so happy that I finally reached my homeland. I can hear the That's one heavy carriage. Polish tongue. Fellow countrymen, welcome. Which part of Poland are we in? For I'm not familiar with this region. Hey, mister, what were you up to yesterday, if you don't even know which country? We are in Ireland, as it happens. Are you Polish? Have you also come to work? No. I must have got here by mistake. What a coincidence. The first people I meet are my countrymen. What? A coincidence? What coincidence? Whichever stone you turn, there's a pole jumping out. A plumber, a manager. How are we to uphold tradition here? Really? Go. go on, show. Hope we didn't land in Northern Ireland. You are, as I understand, a local? Well, what are you waiting for? Aren't you scared of me? Since I've been back, I've seen stranger things, and some people would even be scared of me. I'm a musician. Frederick Chopin. On his way... But this guy isn't wearing a hood. A musician, you say? That's very interesting. I am Leprechaun Leon, and I'm here to promote tradition and folk music. We even have a band here, the Gooseberries. Daisy, boys, come here. A musician from Poland came to visit. What? Look at that, a Polish musician. We've never had one of them before. We had professors, IT specialists, or even lawyers. But a musician? I haven't seen one yet for sure. You gotta be kidding me. By mistake. And anyway, Does I'm Poland have no musicians? Certainly not. No way. We uphold tradition here. Since you haven't run off, we won't let you go until you pass the test. If you succeed, you'll get a pot of gold. But if not, we shall drown you. Great. What test shall we give him? If he's a musician, let's have him play better than us. We were going to practice in the afternoon anyway. Fantastic. And if he loses, off to the sea with him. Man, I want to actually just lose this to see what happens. You know? Frederick versus the Etude number nine. Gasbury. And G flat? No, and G major. Etude number nine. I don't remember this one. Oh, do I not get music for this one? Is it just a silent performance?
Is this a real Chopin piece, or did they make this up? I mean, I get this arrangement partly fictitious. Part, partly fictitious. But, like, is this based on an actual musical work? Because I can't say I've heard of it. <sighs> okay, well. Sure. We nailed it. We got the pot of gold, apparently. I like this too easy mode. It allows me to hear all the music and not have to perform too well at it. Although, honestly, I wouldn't... Would not mind winning with any score, to be honest. You played well, but I didn't want to be drowned. Where have you got the pot of gold? Oh, we don't really have a pot of gold. Uh huh. No, we only have debts. The banks are harassing us. You don't That's say. We provoked you. He promised to pay them off for us. Which him? The one who brought me back? A the one in the hood? Man in the hood? It's not just anyone. It's Mastermind X himself. He foresaw that we might lose. And in which case, he made us pass on the message that tomorrow noon, he will be waiting for you in your homeland, in Warsaw, on top of the tallest palace. I thought I got hit by mistake because of the storm. He is powerful. He can do anything. A storm or fog like this, he can make it just like that. Beware. Why should I believe you? But okay. Seems like a wise move, maybe. Also, we only ended up in Ireland by accident, so What a truly beautiful sight. Only where is the villain? How about right there? Oh, never mind. That's not the villain. For me? Do I speak to this? Thank you. It's Frederick. Hello? Take a look ahead. Excuse me? Okay. Hey look, it's Mr. X and the hood. Um That's pretty fantastic. Does he not have a face? Yeah, that's me, the savior of humanity. Savior? You destroy huh. music. Me? It was you who defeated the last independent musicians of show business. They ran what? to me. Here are their contracts. <laughs> so it was your diabolical plan? You. I'm the biggest music producer in the world. What? You are an incarnation of evil. I know. Thanks. I will stop you. Let's fight. You have no dough to get to the club where I bought you. Let alone fight me. Yeah. I exist on a different level. You get it? No, I'm pretty sure I don't yes, get it. But don't understand why you are stroking a pig all the time. Don't talk like this about piggy! You are no one! I'll buy you out right away! I'm rolling in it! Understand? Okay. Whatever. What do we have here? Frederick versus Mastermind is... Lithuanian song in F major, opus 74, number 16.
Du Hast. Du Hast. Sorry about that. This is getting trickier. that rhythm. Yeah, I passed it somehow. Ish, maybe. Close enough. Thank goodness for easy mode. Do not touch. <gasps> he pushed the button that said do not touch. What? You can't do this to Freddy. Freddy didn't deserve that. Oh, what? Wait, bonus song? Since when? Oh, never mind. Never mind. We had a cutscene in the middle of that. That's just Dear really confusing. Ladies. Frederick, this is the end. All what? Is lost. Don't say that. This isn't the end of the world. But it is. We got a contract from Mastermind. We couldn't refuse. He's so handsome. <laughs> What? I will defeat him. I'll free you. Frederick, no offense. You play wonderfully, but um, your music doesn't do it. Excuse me? Your music lacks the heart. <sighs> exactly. It lacks. So this is why I felt such an inner void all the time. Frederick, your heart is right beside you. Wait. So are we gonna get like Liebestraum? No, that's less. Yeah. Horror of horrors! It cannot end like this. Yeah. What piece are we gonna get next? I wonder. Something with heart, apparently. Heart and soul. That's it. I am uh. my country. My heart is here. Some Polish song. Guitar. Seems like something you play.
Photoplasticon. Wow. All the museums are sold. This is supposed to be beautiful. I don't get it. I'll buy it. It's not for sale. <laughs> yeah, are you kidding me, man? <laughs> Everything's got its price. How much? It's a symbol of music. Those who love music hold it in their heart. Those who trade it. No, but seriously, how much? Yeah. Heart and talent are two things you never had. Me living! Me living! Me! Yeah. Okay. So heart and soul. Frederick versus oh, like a, yeah. I thought this was going to happen earlier. But finally we get this one. It's a straight rhythm. It's a straight rhythm, which is driving me nuts. Honestly, a syncopated rhythm would much be a lot simpler for me. I don't recognize this part. I can't read that. I'm not sure what it's asking me to play. Rock on. Of course you have to end with that. It's too dramatic to end with anything else. Although no, Chopin's written a number of dramatic pieces, but yeah. But the interesting part is the left hand in that piece, which is notably absent. Um, musicality. Musicality. Yeah. No combo. It's impossible! Your money doesn't work in here. But everybody has their price, right? Well, I don't. Yeah, you do. Ah, uh, whatever. I like you, you know. Play what your heart tells you to. I'm leaving the business. Really? Yes, really? I realize that my behavior harms society. I'll only take five bonuses before I leave, and I will live off royalties and commission like a common, honest man. Hold it. W what's up? Give it back. Oh, well, everybody needs to look after themselves. Uh -huh. Farewell, Piggy. Farewell, Chopin. Give back the musicians' contracts. Right. No, 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 please. 
They are free. But without them, I'll be so very, very plain. Well, that's too it bad now, isn't it? Your health, mental health. Oh, God damn it, Chopin. You'll pay me for this. Maybe. But first, as a punishment, I sentence you to listen to your own music. Oh, no. Anything but this. This is a music substitute product. You could get poisoned. Which you flooded the world with. Uh. Now who's the villain? Just saying. It doesn't matter what kind of music people play, as long as it flows from their heart. Am I right, dear ladies? Oh, yes, yes, Frederick. You have set us free. Thank you. Wow. That was an abrupt 180 from the previous scene. Yeah. Go musicians? It's kind of a anti-industry bias in there. That's kind of odd. So, um yeah, I, I, I don't know, I kind of like the story behind the game. It's pretty amusing, the characters you run into, the places you run into them. Their artists did a great job. The soundtrack is pretty decent. Um, I'm sure if I played this in a mode other than super easy mode, um, I'm sure the gameplay would be pretty awesome too. No pianos or har pigs were harmed in the making of this. This is good news. 2012. Dun dun dun. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's the resurrection of music. Wow. Okay. Um. I think I've said my piece on this. It could still be a fun thing to practice from time to time. But, um. I think it would fare better, like I was saying, with a larger keyboard. Either in terms of the keys, you're actually supposed to press on a, uh. Windows keyboard. And or with a wider set of keys on the screen, somehow. Somehow just playing it with that particular layout on the screen is very difficult to read. Maybe that's intentional, but some notion of, I don't know. But yeah, I think overall, good game. It's, um, again, on Steam Summer Sale, along with another game in the series, so go check it out uh, if that's your thing. I'll try not to bore you with this sort of thing in the future, but I don't know, it's fun for me to try new stuff once in a while. Instead of the same old, same old. I keep saying we'll keep going back to the old favorites, and I'm sure we will return to that soon, but I've got such a backlog. So, we're gonna see how many more we can get through, and then, um, then back to the same old, same old. So, hope you enjoyed this. Um, or we're not too badly inconvenienced by having to learn where all the places were on the globe, um, what the various cultures are around the globe, and how chariots can travel over oceans. Hey, welcome. Uh, we just finished Frederick, the resurrection of music. So, yeah, I'm thinking perhaps I give the other game a try. Frederick Evil Strikes Back. I uh, did not see this listed under the Steam games game options, but I think this is something I should still be able to stream. So let's pick this up in 720p and um, just verify that, that you can capture this and hopefully this works well. Ah, Frederick 2. 
Okay, so this game is the sequel. How's this look? Okay, it does capture. Play a little of this. Um, got controls options. Um, now, as much as I said, like I think this would fare better with the wider keyboard. I'm not sure that... I don't know. Do I attempt this with the right hand this time? Uh, let's give this a try with the right hand. J, K, L, semicolon. Oh, I can't do that. Well, that's awful. Why can I not do colon, semicolon? Do I have to pick a letter? Jeez. Fine. This is so gonna throw me off, but... H, J, K, L. U, I. You, note that if you have like a special Dvorak keyboard or Azerty or such, this is probably a pretty really useful feature. Um, unless you change your keyboard mode, just for the sake of playing this game. Let's play this again on too easy mode. The sweet taste of victory. Yeah. Oh, what happened to the voice acting? It's got quiet. Hey girls, what's up? So this is in 60 FPS. It's beautiful. Honestly. Oh no, a thing happened. What happened to, like, our box that had our golden carriage and golden piano in it? Or not a golden piano, but just a really nice piano. A grand piano. No, no. Who's that? Who's that? Uh, that doesn't answer my question. So Let's see, we're up to our good old tradition of um, characters who don't make any sense. <laughs> In which you will be a puppet. Find Falcon in Vienna and follow the path I have prepared. Okay. True music never dies. Your princess is another castle, Chopin. Deal with it. No, I can't ride in this anymore. It's great to show off, but it's passe nonetheless. What? Too modern. Something more classic and cult. Yes, yeah, seriously. Get with it. That is cult. Too cult and too slow. Come on. Class and power. Puppet master, I'll get you. In style. All right, so. Oh wow, there's a lot of destinations on this map. Vienna! It is bigger than I remember it. What a great number of travelers from far eastern lands have come to visit. Still, no matter what secret alleyways you may hide in, I will find you, Falcon. I am sure I will find you. I can feel it. And when my intuition tells me to stop, I stop. Do I? What's the matter? Be quiet, you criminal! You terrorist! You're the what? enemy of his democratic order! You've broken the rules! You failed to keep the old note! Understood? Okay, whatever. You are like two peas in a pod! You must undergo a psychoanalytical inspection! Watch out! I'm so confused. My pleasure. Okay. Can I play the song now, please? Whatever the song is, it's sure to be better than this cutscene. 
Vini, Vostro, Schnitzel. When I was little, I always wanted to have a dog. But uh, my mom never let me. Uh, did you have a dog when you were younger? Do you want I really need to boost the game it? volume. I can't hear it. All right, enough chattering. Let's play. But already. And what about the psychoanalysis? You lured me here for a duel, right? In a way. Use music to somehow do the psychoanalysis. Whatever. Red Chopin versus Falcon. Wait. So what happened to the whole playing classical works thing? Classical stuff, though. Yeah, this is challenging for sure. too many notes. At least it doesn't suffer from what the first game suffered from, which was a lack of notes. Um, but in too easy mode, I would expect something something. I mean, it's forgiving enough, but... Close enough. We survived it. Somehow. Barely. But yeah, I think this game steps up the challenge. Um, it's not exactly what I'm looking for right now, but... So we got a little taste of what this game contains. Musicality. Yeah, that's wonderful and all. Um, I'm sure we'll come back and try to ace both of these games at some point. Yeah, that's Frederick, um, both uh, Frederick Resurrection of Music and Frederick Evil Strikes Back. So, hope you enjoyed. Um, we'll get back to our old favorites soon. But yeah, thanks for watching. Um, 
Let's go find somebody to host. Uh, and yes, yeah, see you around. Have a good night.